Okay, hey. Uh, 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 yeah, so my thing messed up and when I was boarding, so yeah, but anyway, I finally have babies now, so I had to go back and we do some, I had to be back and we do something, so now that we fix stuff, now that we fix things. I'm just gonna put the door back on there like I had. Okay. Now well, let's this up and Unless you saved me from misery. Good for you, but I was hoping to find somebody else. I assume you're feeling disappointed. What are you looking for? My cat, my living cat, Mr. Midnight. Honestly, I'm not very fond of cats, you know. A black one's very big girl is trying to catch me. Really? He seemed to get in trouble often. Wait, maybe he's my cat. Oh, my lady, if he is, he's in one trouble now. What? One in trouble now. Why? What happened? I can show you. Follow me. It's far from, far from here. The big old pig is dead, sir. Thank you. Now we eat. I can't. Just so you know, inside the beetle is no cat, but a rat. A rat? Oh, I am so sorry. You see, my eyes are very old. I also have a heart problem and very bad luck. I also suffer from no narcolepsy. <laughs> Whatever. Sometimes I don't. It feels hard to sleep. Okay. Here we are. So much I can miss. They just disappeared. The. Oh my goodness. Could you be more specific? Specific. <sighs> I can't speak. I wish I could. I looked into. It looked like the earth swallowed them up. Mm -hmm. Go. Is there anything else I can do for you? Just let me out. I'll be around. Oh wait. Excuse me. Do you still have a comb? Oh, the comb. The shiny beef hat comb. Give it to me right away. Alright then, but can you please comb my hair first? Yes. I can comb your hair. Oh. Thank you, my lady. You are very kind. Now I will go and back to the. Oh yes, here we go. Now let's use this. Have you found the filthy yet? Yeah, go find a way to back at home. But this. Okay, come on. Why is it not? There we go. Here's your beautiful come. Yay, and then now I'll fly away. Hope the key opened the door you wish to open. Now we fly south. Goodbye. Now I can have the key. Give me the key. Oh, beautiful. Goodbye, shiny misters. Have a nice trip. Yeah, I have the. Okay, now we can go into. The door. Yeah. And in we go. I wonder where it leads me. Mr. Midnight, are you here? Uh oh. Oh dear. I've fallen a new double personality in my body. Oh my goodness, where am I? Huh? 
Uh, who is this? A hat? This is midnight. Oh no, your head, kitty. Wait, just a second. This is not my key. This is well, weird hat. Anyways, I have to find. I have to find Kitty. I hope you're here somewhere. Let's see. Let's take a look around. What else with this? Wait, can I go look in? I can throw them. Nah, I put the hand dude. Watch your hands. Still same place, never mind. No, nope, let's continue. Um, yeah, that's true. Ah, uh, I don't know. Yeah, could pick. Hmm. Let's go. Boom. I hear the boom. And it's candles. Going here. Am I? I need to confuse this. Damn, we have enough stuff. It's like teenager. Who's a person that's like teenager? <laughs> okay, let's see. Let's go. Oh my goodness, it's a Oh, it's a little. In here. I can't see. Sorry about you. Oh. Oh, dang. Oh, hello, babies. If you see this, if you saw them together. It's a minute. Are you here, Kitty? Meow. I found you. Oh my goodness, you're a In my blood friend, I found you. Friend, is that really you? My dear friend, finally. Let me see you. It's me. Come closer. Let me see you. Please let me see you. A oh, friend, I'm so happy to see you. I miss you very much. I had dreams about you. And here you are. Thank you for not giving up. I love you, my friend. I love you too, Mr. Midnight, and I really miss you, missed you. Oh, dear Fran, how did you find this place? After those people took me away in the woods, I tried to follow them. But after a while, I got lost. My sense is too weak to, tra to track you. I tried to catch some food to recover, but something happened. Someone took me and put me in his cage. Oh, dear. I will open the cage. We need to get to, get to Aunt Grace. Grace. Fran, I'm very tired. I wish everything was just a bad dream. Everything is going to be fine. We just have to get out of here. Fran, can I ask you something? Sure, Mr. Midnight. What is it? Did you feel like presence in your dream? Yes, I, yes, I did. You told me to take the medicine to find you. What medicine, Fran? It wasn't really me talking to you. I think somebody was helping us get together. Every time I had dreams about you, I felt... The present of something else. Really? What kind of presence? Present, yeah. For what I felt, it wasn't human, but it, but it was really peaceful and kind. 
That's the real magic. Great to have somebody else taking care of us. Fran, did you hear that? Did you- Oh, I'll see what it is. I'll try to find a key and lock you. Oh, I, I love you. What is up with those people? So there's, there's, oh, dear. Oh, you scared me. I thought nobody was living here. There you are. We were waiting for you. Where is your head? My head? My head is just right in its place. You precious being of the other world, who would ever believe us? I'm very confused now, ladies. What are you talking about? Frambo, that's your name, right? And your mom and dad died tragically. Very brutal, right? And I really want to know he killed them, right? So down, how is it you know all of this? We just know. We have to. We are part of this world. But don't be sad. Bad things happen to all of us all the time. I wish I was at home with mommy and daddy now. Don't wish for things that can't be done. Find solutions and answers. I should do that, but mommy and daddy will never come back. Drink some tea and eat, eat some cake. It will make you feel better. He, thank you, but really, I need to know. He told you all these things about me. Are you scared, Fanro? Of course not. I'm just curious, that's all. I'm mostly confused. You haven't asked about your cat yet, Mr. Midnight. That's very odd girl who does a cat more than anything else in the world. And yet you look so calm after finding him in a cage, hungry and scared. Shouldn't it be us trembling and fear for you? I love him, and that is why I'm here. I didn't mean to be rude to you. You want him back? He's my best- yes please, I really wish to have him back. He's my best friend. Before we s set him free, tell us about how it is you came here. It's a long s story. I escaped from a place. A very ugly place that opens heads of children to find out what's wrong with them. Phil told me a secret I was clever enough to find a way out. And then I came to the woods and met a giant ant and killed a bug. It was terrible. Be a bug something. And then I met a rat he wanted his head to get his hair done. And then I made a door, and the door took me here. But then when I entered the door, something happened. I don't remember anything. Uh, and I saw a real pine cone family. That was before I came here. They live in Mr. Antonio's house. They like berries. And uh, I saw flying insects that got stuck in trees because of they have long hair. They also... Uh, that was also in the woods, and now I'm here looking for Mr. Midnight. That was some adventure, friend. How old are you? I am ten years old, but I have to, I have to turn eleven soon. And you? We are sixteen years old. Much older than you, so you have to obey us. I don't want to obey you. You can't tell me what to do. You haven't even asked our names. That's not polite. And you shouldn't wander the house without permission. Are you stupid? A stupid little girl with no family at all? Stop that, please. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be rude. Are you crying? Because if you are, you'll get in trouble. If you don't do exactly what we say, your cat, you and your cat will die. Do you understand? No, you don't scare me. Free my cat now. You idiot. You asked for it. If you don't do it, ask. Bad things will happen to your cat. We will force you to kill him with your own hands. You are evil and poisoned, but I'll do what you say. Good. Now listen to us carefully. We need to perform a little magic trick on us. Do you like magic? Yes, Annie all did ma uh did magic. Annie did ma magic, but she didn't have any idea how to actually do it. Anyway, this magic is very powerful and tremendous and dangerous. Here's the recipe. Be cautious and price. Other things help or otherwise terrible things can happen. Why can't you do it yourselves? We can't do it. It would kill us. You see, we weren't like this before. There are two there used to be two different people and two different bodies. But how is that you are like this now? One night, a long time ago, something appeared in front of us. 
We thought he was an angel, but he was not. He decided that we should spend eternity together. He cursed us to be like this. We never understood why. We had the spell to bring him back. But if we do that later, we when we are not attached to each other anymore, and show him that he is powerless and maybe he will regret it. That sounds terrible. I'll try my best to help you. We're going to gather some things you need for the ritual, and because you have not been a very nutty girl, you won't be allowed to talk to your able to talk to your cat. You'll have to wait until he comes. We come back. I understand. I'll be waiting here. Ben, do you see this key? Can you imagine what can be opened with it? Can you, silly, silly little girl? Okay, I am going to end it there for now, and I will see you in the next video.